The kilowatt by P3 International is a simple household energy meter. Use it as a tool to measure how much electrical energy your appliances consume. You can also use it to find phantom loads, items that consume power even when they appear to be off. To use it, just plug it in line between any appliance and a wall outlet. First, plug the kilowatt directly into the wall outlet. If there's power to that line, you'll notice that the display lights up and shows information. Then, plug the appliance into the socket on the kilowatt. At this point, you can find out a number of bits of information, including the line voltage, the amperage and wattage power consumption of the device if it's on, the line frequency, and the last button is for kilowatt hour consumption. That'll be zero at first. Leave the kilowatt plugged in for a day or a week and come back to see what it's done. When you return to read the kilowatt meter, it may be handy to have a flashlight so that you can see the display better. The first press of the red button will show the total kilowatt hour consumption of the appliance since it was plugged in. Another press of the button will show the accumulated hours since that time. Be sure to write this information down. When you're finished, unplug the kilowatt from the wall outlet. You'll notice that the display immediately goes blank. That's because the kilowatt has no batteries and no memory, so be sure to write down your information first. Oh, and don't forget to plug your appliance back in. So what do you do with the information you've recorded from the kilowatt meter? A few simple calculations with those numbers can teach you a lot about how your appliances use energy. For example, dividing the kilowatt hour figure by the hours of use tells you the hourly energy consumption rate for that appliance. In our example, that's 0 0.059 kilowatt hours per hour, but since the device is a refrigerator and refrigerators cycle on and off as needed, that's not a very useful number. But knowing there are 24 hours in a day, you can determine how many days the appliance was plugged in. In our example, 168 hours is 7 days. So we now know we can derive an appliance's daily kilowatt hour consumption from the meter readings for total kilowatt hours and hours of use. It's a good idea to measure cycling appliances like refrigerators and freezers over longer periods of time so you get a more useful average. That's all for now. Watch for other helpful videos from the Alternative Energy Store.